Yo, what is going on guys? This is episode 5 of my Wind Waker playthrough. And I'm gonna hop into the world in it. And, uh, we just got our sail. So we just got- oh! Because we jump right into a cutscene. Oh, that look on your eye. What? In your eye. So you found yourself a sail, have you? Very well, then I shall teach you the way out of sailing. Come next to my hull and press A to climb aboard. Set the sail you got to Y, Z, or X, and press the same button to hoist it. The sail will catch the wind, which will push the boat forward. The arrow that appears behind the indicates the wind direction. Use the stick to steer if you wish to move quickly. Uh, yeah, try now and adjust your speed. And I didn't understand any of it. I still think it's really weird that there's a talking boat right here right now. Yep, on a sea chart. Uh, yeah. Uh, and, uh, press up to see sea chart. Alright, now a westerly wind blows. Hop in and it carries to the east. To a noob. Westerly means it comes from the west. So, yeah, just let you know if you were dumb. Where is this area? Well, I guess it's to where this is. Throw off this sail here. Oh, speed. Zoom to zoom. Yeah, well, anyway, I got my uh, vision rotated. Or whatever. I've had to invert it. I did that in the settings. The side to side. So when I play the... The what's it called? I'll have to do the opposite of what I'm supposed to do. So it's gonna be hard to get used to. But whatever. I'm probably gonna cut out the sailing. But this is the first time, so I'm not gonna cut it out. Like through the through the rest of the series, because there is a lot of sailing. So I'm just going to uh, leave it in for this episode. Ooh. I see you. Your money, cash money. Should I go up there? Yeah, we should, because I guess if I am filming this, I guess I should jump in, might as well. Holy crap. Uh, this is difficult. Okay, here we go. And we climb up the ladder. The music is really nice. We were just there. And we're heading for that big thing over there. Look at these badasses. Stealth. I can't whoop his ass. Okay, well he fell off. This guy's deaf apparently. Oh, he fell off too. Ooh, a chest spawn. Oh yeah, never mind. I knew that. I knew that was gonna happen. Probably one of those pendant things. Ooh, 20 groups. What up? Oh, okay. I'm gonna break this shit so we got here. Pretty young money, cash money. Give me that. Oh. Ooh. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Lots of dough, lots of cheddar. I gotta stop saying this weird stuff. Where you at, boat? King of Red Lions. Let's get sailing. I don't think any boat can sail this fast that quick. Well, I guess the sail comes out pretty fast, so. Look at them damn seagulls. How ugly they are. Oh, I was just sailing randomly, I'm like drunk. Police come up behind me and charge me for DUI. Them seagulls are loving it though. They're still loud as fuck. Yep. Alright. Alright, we're getting all these roops. I didn't set a timer, holy crap, I did that again. Oh, bit of roops in the cutscene. I think. 10 minutes is solid. 
They're on the horizon. No way, man. That's the destination link. Dragon Moose Island. Dragon Moose Island. I don't have to do the music. High atop the island's peak lives the spirit of the skies. A great dragon by the name of Valu. Cool, man. You must go see this dragon and request from him a jewel called Din's Pearl. Alright. Ask the people of the Rito tribe who inhabit this island about how to see the dragon. Alright. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker. It is a baton of sorts that was used long ago when the people played music in Prayer to Gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the power of the gods, but I do not know if it still works. What is it, like, break? It looks like a stick. Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should try using it. Alright, man. First, conduct three-quarter time. Do not touch the stick and use the thing with that. Oh. So I have to I have to do left when it goes right. Is this four quarter or full time? I don't even know. Okay, to the uh, to there. Up, oh, left, right, down. That's what I have to do. Up, oh, shit, shit. Oh my god, why is it going so fast? Up, oh, left, right. Down, shit. Up, left, right, down. There we go. We got it. That's it, Link. That was not bad for your first time using it. The wind waker, not bad at all. You can also try in six quarter time by tilting that way. You would do that. Remember it. It was weird what I just said. I messed it up really bad. I'm not. I, okay, whatever. I'm gonna do it anyway. I know that there is a. Uh, yeah, I just learned that. There is a tunnel over here. There's a song back here. First time I ever played this game, this is what I did. I might as well go back there and learn it right off the bat. Get used to this stuff. Up, right, left, okay. Which one's my Z? Oh, the bumper, okay. Up, left, right. Up, right, left, yeah, okay. The wind's requiem. Uh, all right. Cool. Mm. It was a mighty dice breeze. Holy shit. He wasn't very like startled. Name Zephos. Blue Zephos. Yep. I'm the god of winds. So you are the new wind waker, are you? I guess, man. Great, great. For a beginner, you've got a nice wind. Wind sense about you. I like you, kid. Holy shit, he's like glitching around. That tune you just picked up, well, it gives you control over the direction of the wind blows. What? Depending on how it's used, wind can be a good thing or a very bad thing. You want an example of it being a bad thing? Then you should see my brother. It saddens me to say that my brother Cyclos is miffed about his monument here being broken. And now he spends his time creating cyclones to torment people with. So if you encounter any cyclones at sea, chastise my brother for me, will you? I don't even know what that means. And that is my request for you. <laughs> Alright, man, just don't laugh like that again. Cool. Alright, we just learned the song pretty soon. Pretty early in the game. I don't got no bombs, can't blow that up. 
speed up. Look at me hints. He looks at where you're supposed to go. I'm supposed to pick these up. Everybody knows what these are. Oh shit. Why did you uh, throw? Oh yeah, don't you press a different button to drop it? Yeah, you do. Ooh. Besides sing. We sniped that. That was a good throw. I'm gonna appear. We're gonna sit up. Oh! Calm down there, Jimmy. Don't get ahead of yourself. Do -do, do -do. Look at the music. It's really weird right now. I can do that. So you use a drop button, isn't it? Oh, we need this. Look at that, it's floating there. What do you do to get up here? Oh, this. Oh, good thing I got the grab thing put on two different buttons. So once I'm in combat, I can click the stick to use my shield, or I can use the bumper thing if I want. Oh, look at this guy. I guess he's chilling out here. That's that crazy ass motherfucker we looked at in through the telescope. And he was yelling at that part. Is it? I'm pleased to see you are okay. What the hell, I must say. You've traveled far for one with no wings. Well, you know, there's kind of water everywhere. And your sister, is she dead? Yep. Ah, fuck. Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll... not haunt you. I have an idea, Link. Would you come... Would you like to meet our chieftain? Whatever. Okay, man. I've told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. All right, all right. I'm certain the chief Tame will befriend you and lend you the aid of your of our airy. Wait, what? What is that? Anyway, it's settled. Then I'll fly on ahead, and you let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, Link. I'll be waiting. Sounds sexual. I don't want it to be sexual. It's a Zelda game. It's not supposed to be sexual. Is it, Link? No, not really, is it? Stop! Do you, would you rather me look around like this all the time or just use Z? Because I've always been used to using Z and stuff. Ooh, this is going to be a long cutscene. I forgot about that. Well, have you discovered the cause of the Great Value's anger? Nope, I'm dyslexic. And he flew away. Ah, so, you are Link, are you? Quill has told me all about you. A troubling tale indeed. I insist that you let us know if there is anything we can do. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. All right, man. However, in the meantime, we have a problem, our own, to deal with. Okay. When you arrived to the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? Yeah, man. As you can see, we of the Rito tribe are profoundly connected to the sky. We make our livings on the airways. I thought you said railways there for a second. <laughs> we do. We do so by the graces of the sky spirit, Falu. When a Rito reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost Isle to receive a scale from the Great Dragon. Isle. Why'd I say Isle? Alarm just went off. Ha! Sniped it. 
it is the scale that enables Dorito to grow his or her wings and fly. And fly. Recently, however, the once gentle Valu has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. If this continues, the fledglings who are of age will never be able to receive scales from Valu on Dragon Roost. They will remain wingless, and in time, our very way of life will be threatened. As Chief Tain of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? Yeah, man. Happy face. Chief Tain, what do you think of consulting Link with regards to your son, Prince Kamale? As you can see, Link is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That maybe. Maybe that guy didn't have a ball and ass chin strap. He'd be able to talk to his own kid. Let me be direct, my son. Kamali is of the age to earn his wings. Yet he is weak in some ways, and in light of the current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. Holy cow, he's suicidal. What say you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Will you meet with my son? Ha <laughs> yeah, smiley face. I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible so that we may better help you with yours. I have something I wish for you to give to my son. A young girl named Medley is holding it for me. Would you find her and take it? I'm continuing on. I'm counting on you. <laughs> wow, that's weird. Don't! No, don't talk to me. Oh my god. Here, Link, take this with you. Who knows, it might come in handy. Shipment bag. Yep. Delivery bag. Not a shipment bag. This isn't UPS. And there's so many pockets, you can fit items and stuff in there and press stuff and then lock it on stuff. You should find Medley in one of those upper rooms. Leave the great Valu to us. In the meanwhile, do your best to aid Prince Kamali. And that's where I'm going to end off that video. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.